I paid a stranger to film and make a movie of my car. This could go either really good or really bad. So this is Alex. Hey, we're gonna be filming the car. We're both gonna make a cinematic of it. And to be honest, I've never seen the car moving. So I'm, I'm very excited to see that. So he's gonna film the car. I'm gonna film the car. And then we're both going to edit it. And I'm going to react to both and compare and just see who did better. But before we actually get into filming the car, it needs to be cleaned. So let's just go wash it real quick. Right, so before we do anything, we need to wash the cars because, well, my car is very dirty. And now it is time for foam. Ooh, very foam. New X, 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 so I just want to give you guys a quick look at this like really cool mural spot. So basically this is just a really big wall on a bridge essentially that a bunch of people decided to put a cool mural on and I've seen people parked up here and take pictures and video and whatnot next to the wall but unfortunately there's a massive curb right here and to be honest my car is lowered. It would not survive trying to get over this even if I like went as far as over here. There's no way that car is going over this curb unfortunately and I technically don't think we're supposed to be back there so yeah let's not do that. It was a Malibu. That's Iowa. That was a Malibu. Anyways, I just can't help but fall in love with this car. So now we're gonna go get some rollers and then, yeah. Let me introduce you to Alex real quick. Hi, I'm Alex. I am a videographer for Daily Driven Death Traps. And I got into videography about a year ago and I actually go to college for videography. I haven't learned anything from college, just all YouTube. Okay, so we did rollers. I didn't film any of that because obviously I'm driving. I'm not gonna film as I'm driving, focusing on getting the shot. So now we're on top of this parking garage with an insanely like sick view of downtown Des Moines, Iowa. Best place in the country, by the way. I'm kidding. So we have the sunset happening very soon. We're gonna get some super sick shots of the car in front of the city skyline. I think it's gonna be super sick, to be honest. It's time to go home, edit, and react to the videos. All right, so I'm back home. I've edited my cinematic. First, we're gonna watch my cinematic, and then we're gonna watch Alex's, and then we're gonna compare. But before we get into that, you know what else I like to compare? My channel to other channels that are doing good, and maybe even see what I can do better on my channel. And I do that with TubeBuddy. TubeBuddy is a Chrome add-on. As you're browsing through YouTube, it'll show you different statistics about a certain video or channel. They also have different tools that you can use, where you can A-B test thumbnails, titles, description, and then at the end of that period, it'll tell you which thumbnail, title, or description did better so that you can make your videos do better all around. It literally takes three clicks. All you need to do is click the link in the description or go to TubeBuddy.com slash Donics, click the install button, click add to Chrome, and then click add extension. Like I said, it's only three clicks and it could honestly change your YouTube experience. So install it, it helps me out. Anyways, let's get into comparing the actual videos. I'm very excited. So I'm going to react to my version first and I'm going to, I mean, obviously I've kind of already seen it. I've edited it and I'm going to kind of just watch it with you guys. Ooh, dude. Ah, my car looks so good. A little cut. I love those wheels so much. I love that shot and that. Ooh. So good. Love it. So super quick and simple on that one. Obviously, I don't really have the equipment that Alex does. I literally just have my camera. So it's hard to get some shots that are similar to what he did. But to be fair, I think for the amount of time that I had, I think that still came out pretty dang sick. I think a couple of my favorite shots on mine were probably the bit with the shift knob and the Ultramotive logo. Just kind of the way that the sun reflected off of the sticker. It honestly looked super cool. All right, we've watched my cinematic and Alex just sent me his cinematic. So I'm not very confident that mine's going to be better than his, but I haven't seen his yet. So I'm going to get my first reaction to it. I'm excited. All right, let's just get into it. All right. Ooh, it looks good. Yes, sir. Oh, this is so sick to see. Ooh. Oh, this makes me happy. This makes me real happy. Little sound effect. Okay. There's your boy. Your boy. 
Ooh, the gunshot, okay. Gosh, I love this car so much. Oh, I love it. So good. Ooh, that shot is so good! <laughs> Oh, this is too good. Oh, that was nice. Oof. Ah, oh, it looks so good. Oh my god. It's so good. I've been outdid. I've just straight up been outdid. That was so good. That was actually so good. That was worth the money. I'll tell you that right now. I think a couple of my favorite shots have to be probably the bit where I'm driving up the parking garage. First of all, those transitions were just clean in general. And two, like just being on top of that parking garage, the background with the sunset and like the skyline in the back. Ooh, it's too good. It's just way too good. I'm watching it back now too, just trying to pick up my favorite parts. And I noticed there's a bit where I'm walking up to the car. I like miss the door handle. <laughs> I have to go for like the two grab because I missed it there for a second. I'm so glad we cleaned up the car before the shoot as well because look at those wheels, bro. They looked so clean. But I really like the detail that Alex went into with the transitions and the sound design. Definitely go support Alex. Clearly, he's really good at what he does. That cinematic was so sick. Dude, I I'm genuinely so happy with that. So in conclusion, was it worth the money? Yes. Did he do better than me? Yes. If you want to see a video very similar to this where I revealed my car, check out this video. I think you'll really like it. Make sure to subscribe. I'll see you guys later.